Astonishing and breathtaking are some of the words that are used to describe this wondrous place we find ourselves in today. Affectionately known as the Mother City, welcome to Cape Town. At every angle there's beauty to behold and every hour a seemingly new season unfolding from the beautiful Signal Hill, the majestic Lion's Head and of course the big brother of them all, the magnificent Table Mountain. Welcome to Cape Town. A very good afternoon to you and welcome to Newlands Cricket Ground for this match number six of the Mzanti Super League that sees the home, the home side, the Cape Town Blitz, hosting the Jersey Stars, their rivals from the north. It's a little bit of a grudge match today as the Jersey Stars look to make good on some luck and get one back at the Cape Town Blitz. Of course, we all remember what happened last Friday in the opening game of this year's season. It's Quinton, if you toss the coin, Have a look at some of these uh, changes here. Cape uh, Town Blitz, they've made changes as well. Four changes for them. Asif Ali from Moin Ali. Wahab Riaz, the left arm quick from Pakistan, in for Mohammed Nawaz. Uh, Marcus Ackerman for Adiwe Ujima and Kurgi Malokwana for Zuna Fernando. What do you think of those changes? Hi, Alan. Yeah, it's a um, bit of impetus and, and strength on, on all facets, really. Uh, um, Asif Ali, we know, is a guy that can hit the ball really cleanly. We've spoken about Wild Riaz, with a lot of pace, and as we spoke, you know, with this bit of grease coming over the wicket, I think it's something quite exciting to see how he's going to go tonight. Marcus Ackerman is a young talent who I'm really looking forward to see how he goes. He's shown a lot of promise in domestic cricket. Matlokowana, spinner that goes left arm and right arm if he needs to go. So, um, something different we haven't seen before. All right, Josie Stars have also made some changes. Lizard Williams for Dane Patterson, Gerald Kutsir for Delano Pochita. I first saw Gerald Kutsir at the Under-19 World Cup in uh, New Zealand, and he's pacey. He's got some pace. All right, here we go. And... Uh, Straight away, that looks pretty good, all the way through mid-wicket for four. If there was ever a sign of good pace and what there is to look forward to in this wicket, there's the indication right there. This bit of moisture has just greased up this wicket. Josie Stars would have felt prior to that first game, or after the first game, that they needed to tuck it up and bowl slightly straight alliance to Yanaman Malan. Great, a great balance from his, from his side and easily put away. Shot on top of the bounce, and that's really gone quickly for four. Good looking shot, and it's beaten that fielder. This will go for four. It's gone leg side. That has flown absolutely miles into the building site. He's lofted it. And he's lofted it quite well. He'll get four for that. Over his head. We didn't know much about that. That was uh, not aimed there at all, but it goes down as four in the scorebook. It's a little grey and overcast in Cape Town uh, over Newlands. The lights are on. Oh, that's gone nowhere. That's a simple catch. Timber Babuma takes the catch and Gerald Kutsir has announced himself in the Mzanzi here at Newlands. I mean that's really rushed the batter and Yanaman line is such a good player square of the wicket. 10 runs for Yanaman line, 33 for one. <laughs> Pick the bones out of that. Get the ball boys to throw it back. Four gone, 37 for one. Oh, hello. That is a bit different. Goodness me, that's a six. Quinton de Kock, he's in the mood today, and uh, that brings up six. He takes him past 500 MSL T20 runs. Could this be the day where he turns it on? That's it, it's a nick, is it? Gerald Kutsia is turning it on, his first game for Jersey Stars, and he's got the big fish. Both the openers now back in the dugout. He's, uh, he's adjusted his line, probably Quinton is expecting another back of a length ball. Um, it's, it's a case of adapting quickly to him, and he's now managed to execute that line a bit better. It's now 53 for two, sixth over. 
Yeah, situation demands negate dot deliveries. And that's a teeing off in style, is Livingston into the member stand. It's a chilly evening. We had a little bit of um, is it mizzle, that's what they call it in Cape Town, a little bit earlier today. Still very overcast. I'm hoping uh, some more fans come through for an excellent encounter. Just like that. He's taking the attack to the spinners, is Livingston. Construction taking place here at Newlands. Getting a major facelift. Oh, that's a good pickup. For six. Young Ackerman turning it on here at Newlands, and even the Newlands yeah. faithful thinking, yeah, that was a good one. He had to go for it. It falls safely. <laughs> Dan Christian, hopefully he's fallen safely too. End of the over, 11 gone. That was good over from Rabada, 91 for two. You've got to innovate, and uh, Liam Livingston has done so. Will he get four? He will. Oh, he's gone again. Livingston, he is living dangerously, and he picks up for maximum. Lift off for four. It's a masterclass from Livingston. And he's turning it on beautifully here at Newlands. Wonderful festive feeling here in the Western Cape. And it's certainly a tourist attraction that uh, brings everyone to this part of the world. Already been on uh, some of the flights here uh, to the mother city. And, uh, lots of people coming out here to enjoy their holiday. If you've never been out here, this is the place to be. If you're coming to South Africa and there's one place to visit, come to Cape Town. Get it. Oh no! And could that be a run out? But no. Did he get it? An umpire just wants to check if he got his bat down. This will be very, very unfortunate for the Cape Town Blitz. He's safe. Didn't look very confident, did he? Yeah, the time he tied saved him. relief for both batters out there. Catch, good diving catch. Really good stuff. And this is exactly what Josie Stars needed, a timely breakthrough. Was expecting the drive. Yeah, I think he's pulled that really well. He's thought that one through. Ackerman's gone for 17, it's 113 for three. That should bring up four. No, it doesn't. Rabada made some good ground. Really good shot. Finds the gap. And it's uh, racing away towards the boundary. You'll get four. He's gone after that. And he goes to 50 in style, does Liam Livingston. The Pyros go off here at Newlands. The locals enjoying this knock. Yes. Yes. Catches the call, yes. and yes, it is this time. I mean, an estimates catch or a difficult catch. This is Asafani dismissed there for 11, 138 for four in the uh, 16th over. Good numbers. Ow. He might well have taken another 138 for four. Hmm. Oh, how about that? That has been launched for six. 
sort of a swirling, misty drizzle. It's, it's not heavy enough to take the players off the field, but it's in the air. It's uh, quite nasty. Catches the call, and catch it is. Cahiso Robada, and uh, Williams picks up his first. Very important wicket at this stage of the game. The four-man, George Linder, to be dismissed. Just rolled the fingers over that and hit it straight to Cahisa Robota, deep square. Once again, not a very easy catch in these conditions. We've seen the aerial shots of the mist, um, moisture coming in. The uh, Cape Town Blitz now 146 for five in the 17th. Oh, chipped, picked up. What a good shot. It's uh, six maximum. He's picked this up. How well has he hit it? Not well enough. 65 uh, by Liam Livingston. Brilliant knock of 41 balls, 158 strike rate. 163 for six in the 19th. Oh, well bowled. Oh, Chris Gale. He is there to stop those, unfortunately. Given him a bit of width, and you can't do that to Wahab Riaz. He's one of those players that likes a bit of width, and he likes to swing the bat. Oh, he'll get four for this. Probably the best advice going into this long boundary, going into, into the York. Well, that was the ball that he should have been looking at from the start. 20 overs. Have been bowled Wahab Riaz with a sting in the tail for the Blitz. He finishes 29 not out from 13. And Cape Town Blitz have put on a very decent, imposing looking total on the board of 183 for six. Certainly uh, batted well and lit up Newlands tonight with that 65 from 41, 41 from uh, Quinton de Kock. And starts for Milan Ackerman and uh, Asif Ali try to come in. But uh, those 29 runs in quick time there from Wahab Riaz, that could well have tilted the advantage towards the Cape Town Blitz. Josie Stars bowlers was under a bit of a pressure in the start with the, with the conditions, didn't really get much movement off the wicket and through a swing through the air. Gerald could see impressed with his initial spell, but took a bit of a beating towards the end. Spinners really made a massive impact in the game in the middle phase. Uh, Pangisho and Harmer finished off really well, quite economical. They probably would have been the difference between another 20 runs in, in this total. So 183 for six on the board, 184 to win. And the Josie Stars will have to start scoring at 9.2 runs per over. The Blitz have the raw power. And the variety, different angles. Got him! The crowd go up here at Newlands, and Nokia strikes a big blow. The universe boss is on his way. Tempting the batsman to go for it. He did. Only managing an inside edge onto the stumps. Look at the jubilation and a profound smile on his face. Chris Gale walking back without scoring a run. It's a zero for one. Cheeky. And a good result. First boundary of the innings. But hit with power for four. Top of the batsman. Really switched on in the field. Oh, that looks mighty tight. Safe. Just a little bit of hesitation between the calling from Riza Hendricks and Temba Bavuma. Dropped. It would have been a really good catch. He dived forward. He's got a smile on his face because he knows how close that was. 
That's an excellent effort from Livingston. That's what you want to see in the field. You don't want to see the parachute coming out. He's fully committed to creating an opportunity. And he's nearly made it. He's actually just almost ahead of the ball. Heinrich Nekia is thinking that's in the buckets, and maybe not. Excellent shot. Picked up and four. Is that six? Down the ground, there are two fielders there. Mahu will get it. That's an excellent catch from Wahab Riaz. And the dangerous Riza Hendricks has to go. Profound smile on his face. Scored 13 runs, Riza Hendricks, it's 26 for two. Experienced character, another good experienced player for the Cape Town Blitz. Oh, got him. Look at the smile on Quinton de Kock's face. He knows how important that wicket is. And Wahab Riaz has started his Cape Town Blitz career in style. Fetching for it, feeling for it, as did an easy catch for Quinton de Kock. Without troubling the scorers, he's on the way back. It's 27 for three. Oh, that's flicked for four. It's, it's been dull, grey, cold and windy, but otherwise it, it's been a lovely night. <laughs> oh! Just holds on to it and Sisanda Magala strikes. And the Josie Stars have lost another top cricket. 51 for four in the eighth over. 10, 51. Through the gap. It's a chase for Dale Stain. I don't think he's going to win it. Ooh. It's cheeky and it's effective. Four wickets are down for the Josie Stars, chasing 184. Close. That is very close, and the umpire thinks so as well. Spot on first ball from George Linder. Dan Christian departs four runs from score is 64 for five. Got to be converting those thirties. And look at that bang on target, George Linder. That's his strength. Oh dear. Where's this Hawkeye from? I know he's tall, but why spoil it? their team to win this game. Palmer's teed off and he's found the maximum into the crowd on the embankment. He's played a cheeky little shot here. He's played it fine and it'll pick up a boundary. Jersey Stars 88 for five, needing another 96 more runs from 48 balls. Great shot from Bavuma, straight down the ground, and six. Oh, got him. I'm as disgusted. Simon Harmer gone for 20, it's 100 for six. Four runs for Bavuma. That's gone high up in the air. And uh, he was just absolutely nowhere, George Linder. And that couldn't kept underneath that ball. Had to dive in the end. Knife for Kutsia. Great shot. Powerfully struck from Bavuma. Bavuma has uh, hit this high up. Magala's underneath it. He doesn't drop too many. And they've got the danger man, Bavuma. Cape Town Blitz. Lots of smiles all around, and why not? Most threatening side in this Mzanzi League. Really good knock of 62 comes to an end. It's 115 for seven. Particularly in field setting and bowling changes. 
Oh, this is a nice looking stroke. And that has gone four, five rows back for six. Oh, look at that leg stump. It's gone for a walk. Well bowled, Magala. Perfect Yorker. No more heroics from Kahiso Rabada. And big six, he's gone for six, 124 for eight. Skills. Catch it. Quinton de Kock, he knew there was a nick on that. And he dismissed Kutia, four runs, 125 for nine. Full toss, I don't think it was high enough to be considered no ball, but the... Oh, this could be close. Yes, I think that's gone. Umpire's already given it out. It was a risky run. And the Cape Town Blitz are all smiles tonight. Quinton de Kock. Asif Ali in the side tonight with Wahab Riaz, the two Pakistan internationals. 126 in 16.2 overs with uh, Babuma the skipper 62 20 coming from Simon Harmer <coughs> and uh, really wasn't much else there Reza Hendricks who was uh, two half centuries in the two previous games couldn't quite continue that form today so Jersey Stars and uh, Cape Town Blitz bowling Nokia two for 18 one for 33 Del Steyn Wahab Riaz one for 13 three for 17 from Magala what a good cricketer he looks. One for 27 from Connor and Linda. Two overs, one for 18. So a summary of this match here at Newlands at six in the Yanzanzi Super League for 2019. The Blitz, 183 for six. They were put into bat. Livingston, 65. Josie Stars, 126. And Cape Town Blitz winning by 57 runs. So the next match... Uh, is tomorrow Durban Heat against the Pal Rocks. Let's hope that the weather is good for that one. Uh, five o'clock, our coverage will start. That's local time. Fingers crossed for Durban Heat and Pal Rocks. It was beautiful in Pal last Sunday. Let's hope that Pal can take some of that weather to Durban.